Okay, so today on Who Would Win, it is a requested battle between the main man, Lobo, and the spirit of vengeance, Ghost Rider. Now, uh, I have to rely on my memory today and these notes because even though Ghost Rider is on the site that I used to take the screenshots from, he is basically just there. Uh, his powers are there, but as far as his uh, speed and strength and all that other stuff in the power grid, it's not there. So, I have to rely on memory as far as Ghost Rider goes and Lobo as well because I don't really want to show one half of a screenshot. So anyway, uh, let's start with uh, some backgrounds and some origins. Uh, starting with Ghost Rider, there's actually been two of them, uh, Danny Ketch and Johnny Blaze. So uh, what happened is he basically sold his soul to the devil who turned out to be Mephisto and he got the powers of Ghost Rider and his most effective weapon is this stare and what it does is he looks in his victim's eyes sees all the wrong that he has ever done and it casts it back at him and the victim's soul is left to burn in internal agony and stuff like that. He also has a chain that is made out of mystical hellfire uh, at least I think it is that's what it said when I looked up some more information about him because I have looked up information about him before when I did my Scorpion vs. Ghost Rider fight. And he also has Hellfire as well, which can burn pretty much anything, including his victims. And uh, Lobo, his uh, background, his origin is that he killed off his entire race when he was young. And now he is a bounty hunter, so basically he kills anybody he's paid to kill. Like Santa Claus, he's also gone blow for blow with Superman multiple times and even beaten him. So uh, that's saying something right there about his strength. He also has an insane healing factor to the point where he can come back from one drop of blood. And also at one point he can clone himself from one drop of blood as well. And uh, so this will be a very good battle to look at. Uh, as far as strength goes, uh, I may have to give that edge to Lobo. But uh, Ghost Rider is no slouch as far as strength goes. Uh, if he can hold his own with the Hulk, who, as far as the Marvel world, he says he's the strongest one there is, and he may be right about that because the Hulk is getting stronger and stronger and stronger over time due to his anger. So if Ghost Rider can hold his own with the Hulk, then I think that he can hold his own with Lobo. So uh, also that stare, I think that it may work on... Lobo, but I don't think that it would put Lobo down for the count because Lobo, uh, I think he does have a soul to burn, which is why I think that the stare would work on him. But Ghost Rider um, uh, would have to basically do a lot to kill Lobo for good because Lobo was kicked out of both heaven and hell, so he has nowhere to die to. Uh, he was kicked out of heaven for probably obvious reasons, but hell, that's saying something right there. When you are so bad that the devil himself fears you and wants you nowhere near him. And, uh, well, that's uh, basically saying something about how bad this guy is. Uh, Lobo also has guns and stuff like that, but that's not going to do him much good here because guns and knives don't really affect Ghost Rider at all, so... Uh, with that being out of the question, uh, which one do I think would win between the main man and uh, Ghost Rider? Uh, if the stare does work on Lobo, which I think it will, like I said, I don't think he's going to be down for the count. He's going to be incapacitated, but he's probably going to come back because he has nowhere to die to. Uh, so, as far as this battle goes, uh, I think that Ghost Rider would take it, but it's not going to last. Like, uh, he would basically use the stare on him, it would work, and Lobo would be incapacitated, but he's going to come back and uh, go after Ghost Rider again. Uh, if it's like a situation where Lobo was like paid to take Ghost Rider out, then that may be a bit different because then Lobo would know who Ghost Rider is, have time to prep for him, but Ghost Rider wouldn't know anything about Lobo. He still would probably use the stare on him, but uh, also I read one time on Wikipedia just recently where 
Ghost Rider used the stare on Carnage, uh, Cletus Cassidy, and he got knocked out from it. But I'm not 100% sure about that because it was on Wikipedia, and that's not always the most reliable information. So uh, as far as this fight goes, I have to go with Ghost Rider for now, but there's no doubt that Lobo could take it. Uh, oh yeah, and uh, Lobo, I forgot to mention that he also has a chain as well that has a gut hook attached to the end of it, but I don't think that's going to do him much good either because uh, Ghost Rider, I don't think he would be too affected by that kind of thing. But like I said before, uh, I think Ghost Rider is going to take it. But this has been uh, pretty fun to do. Uh, please leave uh, any ideas for a matchup below. This has been B Mitch. I'll see you next week with another Who Would Win. And I may even do a uh, Mugen battle afterwards.